Hey guys, it's Miriam and today I have a brand new story. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Michelle. I'm just doing my research. So I have a brand new story called The Ungrateful Twins. So this is a, a moral story for children. Let's get started. Once upon a time, there lived a poor family in a little hut at the end of a village known as the Fisherman Village. The family consisted of four members. They were Mr. Jackson, his wife Madam Grace, and their twin sons, Joe and Joseph. Oh, hold on. Sorry. Constructed. Consisted. Made up of. Mr. Mr. Jackson was a fishman. Fishman. While his sick wife, Madam Grace, was a housewife. She was too weak to go out and work. Mr. Jackson, the poor fisherman, worked very hard. Fisherman worked very hard. Sustain his family. Sustain. Hold up. Fortunately, his sons Joe and Joseph had never understood the appreciated to and appreciated their father's suffering. Instead, they always compared. Compared their miserable lives with the ones who were more fortunate. This often, often, often made, made Mr. Jackson and his wife sad. Miserable, unhappy, fortunate, lucky appreciate it see the value or good of something or someone Com compare Ex examine to see how things are different or alike next page it was monsoon season the sea was very rough it was raining cats and dogs for almost a week mr jackson couldn't go down to the sea to catch fish since he had no money to buy meat and vegetables madam grace could only cook rice porridge for her family monsoon season a rainy season tired of eating rice porridge joe and joseph complained mom why do we need to eat rice rice porridge every day don't you have anything better to cook hearing this mr jackson felt very sad madam grace too was very sad disappointed and annoyed with her children annoyed angry disappointed make unhappy by failing failing to satisfy a wish or something expected next page they had even once thrown their porridge into the dustbin they were very ungrateful madam grace madam grace tired explaining their family's situation to the both of them but was not to no arrival arrival a veil use ungrateful no thankful not thankful situation set to condition of conditions the monsoon season was still not over mr jackson knew that it would be dangerous to go down to the sea but he had no choice. Joe and Joseph were starving. Mr. Jackson didn't want his children to starve to death. Starving. Be without food in hunger. 
So he risked his life for his children and came home with lots of fish. He sold them in the market. He then used the money to buy lots of delicious food for his children. Joe and Joseph ate the food greedily, delicious, tasty. After eating, Joe and Joseph went to their room and slept soundly. They did not even thank their father who risked his life in order to feed them. Risk, take the chance off. Joe just Joe started to dream to started Joe started to dream. In his dream he saw his father struggling hard in the sea to catch fish. His boat almost his boat almost capsized as the sea was rough. It was raining heavily and the wind was blowing hard. Capsized, overturned, struggling, work very hard. Joe was way awake by a loud noise. It was the thunder. Thunder. The dream that he had was terrifying. The dream had taught him something. He had learned to be grateful to his father who sacrificed too much for his family. Terrifying, scary, sacrificed, give, give. He woke Joseph, Joseph up and related the whole dream to him. him. Joseph too felt that they had to be grateful to their father. Both of them ran out of the room and got their father. Related told, Please forgive us for being very ungrateful to you all this while Dad, Joe and Dad said Joe and Joseph simultaneously. Mr. Jackson, Mr. Jackson and Madam Grace were surprised to see the change of attitude in their children. Simultaneously done at once. At the same time, they were very happy. You must not only be grateful to me, my children, you must you must be grateful to everyone who helps you, advised Mr. Jackson, advised, give suggestion, suggestion, suggestions, next page. From that day onwards, Joe and Joseph had learned to be grateful to everyone. They did not complain about their misfortune, but they were always thankful for what they had. We must always be grateful to our parents and those who help us. If we want others to believe grateful to us, to be grateful to us. Let's ask questions. Okay. What are the names of Mr. Jackson's children? Joe and Joseph. Next question. What does Mr. Jackson work as? A fisherman. Why can Mr. Jackson go to the sea? Because the sea is rough. Why do Mr. Jackson's children complain? Because they are ungrateful. What does Joe dream of? Joe dreams of his father's suffering. Very good, Aram. What uh, did you learn in this story? I learned to be grateful to everyone. Everyone. And what about the children who are not grateful to their parents? If you guys are not grateful to your parents, 
and and they are grateful to you they will risk their lives for you so you guys don't starve to death but what happens when you're not grateful to others if you're not grateful to others they will be not be grateful to you mm, very nice aram bye